Hey team, a lot of people have a lot of different opinions on ancient Egypt. One such misconception is Nefertiti and Nefertari. Some don't know the difference. And that they're actually two different people from two very different time periods. Let's talk about it today. First off, Nefertiti is older and came from the Armada time period. We don't know much about her lineage. She was born around yeah, 1370 and died around 1330 BC. She was married to Akhenaten. Her name means the beautiful one has come. Here is what her cartouche looks like. Nefertari, on the other hand, was a queen or favored wife of Ramesses the Great. She dies in the 24th year of his reign. Uh, her name means the beautiful companion. And let me tell you, her burial tomb in the Valley of Queens is huge and beautifully decorated. Here is what her cartouche looks like. Two very different women living in very different times with similar sounding names, all part of the rich tapestry that was the ancient land of Kemet. Although Egypt wasn't called Kemet then, uh, that is more of an old kingdom name. Uh, don't ask me to pronounce what they called their home during this time, uh, during the New Kingdom. It was so hard to pronounce, the Greeks screwed it up so bad and made a sound with their mouths that resembled the Egyptian name for Egypt, but Hellenized, which sounds like Egyptos, which is where we get the name. They just mispronounced what the Egyptians were calling their home. Fun, fun stuff, huh? Did you mix these two women up? Have you heard others interchange the names Nefertari and Nefertiti? I have. Hence this video. Let me know about your experience in the comments. Thanks for watching.